That Monday Meltdown 100. This is winners round two between Justice Fox and Marth Plastic Boxer. I said that backwards and it confused me for a second. So this matchup is. I don't know. I feel like Fox slightly, slightly outdoes Marth. I mean, no. It's a weird one, obviously, because of Marth's disjoints or whatnot. I just don't feel like it's as bad for Fox as it was in Melee. I reckon Fox in the neutral does okay here because he's just so much more faster than Mark. However, off stage, Fox is going to get absolutely slapped, absolutely bodied because um, that Fire Fox inside B is so, so gimpable for Mark. Oh wow, he just stood there. I don't I think he saw it coming and looked just like that. On the start up of uh, Fox's side B, Plastic Pop goes out there and gets his tip of four there and seals the stop. Very good fast move from Pop Tar. Wow, he actually grabbed him out of his jab. jab. Ooh, unlikely cross up. Down low, just managed to get any follow up. Oh, very good air dodge bait coming up from Justice. So now, that's the proper down to his final stop as well. 50% between them. But he's off stage. That forward smash. Oh, he actually did manage to clip and he jumps off very quickly. Oh, I thought he was going to go for it. He still gets back air. He cannot get back. That's forward air. So good for just shutting down Fox's side B. It was a valiant effort from Justice. If he had been confident enough to go and get that fair foot still, because he did set it up, but he decided to run off there because I feel like he felt like he wasn't going to get it. Are you talking about the forward there that you didn't go for? Uh, I thought you were going to fast forward there when you knocked him off. I reckon you should have went for it, fam. <laughs> 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 Heading straight into game two on Battlefield for Justice's counter pick. He really likes this stage. He often comes here. Probably his most comfortable stage range. It's a very quick damage rack up. If he just manages to actually convert this to a stock, he'd be in a very good position. Down for up air. Ooh, a strange misinput coming out there. Okay, frame traps. He has to stay. He has to stay still. He moved. He should have just stayed still. People need to understand when you do ledge pressure, standing still is very good. If you start moving around, it makes it harder to punish what they're doing off the ledge. Oh. Justice is gonna have to like learn that 
Yes, his up tilt is not always. It's not safe on shield. It's not safe on shield. Just take his time. Just stay. Stand still. Oh, that was a tricky recovery from Pop Tart, to be honest. It was a bit weird. Doesn't manage to get the confirm. Thank, for, thank God in the sense that he didn't get tip aside B. That wasn't tipper. But if he had got tip aside B at that ledge, it would have killed him. Oh, Pop Tart tried to go off. He gets the tech. Side B. Justice desperately needs to take this stop first if he wants to take this to a game three. Back air. Unfortunate. Hundred and fifty one. Uh Pop Tart's not gonna let this stop go by too easily. Uh Justice probably gonna have to get. Oh, what's he spamming those up tilts for? He's done it again. He's landed with back air until up till on shield and gets punished with side B out of shield. Pop Tart showing very good shield patience because he was aware that Fox's throw would not kill him. Oh, very good drop through platform forward there. Oh no! What was going on there? I don't even. I don't understand. I don't understand how he converted that to an up smash, but he did. He's gonna take it 2 0 over Justice. 